New details are emerging in the case against the husband of Mayor Andy Burke's top aide. Channel 3 obtained the case file for the domestic assault case that involved Bobby Stone and his wife Lacey. New at 11, Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Sarah Sidery has some of those documents, photos, and videos that were released. Sarah. Greg Bobby Stone was accused of assaulting his wife, but the charges were dropped. The police file is now public because the case was thrown out. Are you married? Yes, sir. <sighs> I hope yours worked out better than mine did. This is Bobby Stone in the back seat of a Chattanooga police car after a fight with his wife, Lacey. On the way to the police services center, he makes a phone call to tell someone what happened. I caught her kissing the mayor uh, two weeks ago. Yeah, and I thought we were like kind of working through it. And she said that it was just a fluke and blah, blah, blah. Documents in the case file show separate statements from the couple. Lacey told police her husband was paranoid. He believes I have been unfaithful and wants to seek revenge, she said. According to Bobby, he confronted her while she was texting the person she was having an affair with. So let me see your phone. She wouldn't show it to me, so I grabbed it. And we got into a tussle and then turned into like a serious like wrestling match over the phone. Oh, she's probably going to say I hit her, which I didn't. Photos show injuries the Stones say they received from each other during the argument. Bobby admitted he also shattered Lacey's rear windshield with a rock. I threw a rock through that one. Just leave it. It's probably not a good move. But it felt good. Particularly because it had a Burke sticker on the window. Both Lacey and Mayor Burke deny any allegations of an affair. Bobby recently filed for divorce. We reached out to Bobby Stone's attorney, Lee Davis, but he is not making a comment at this time. In the studio, Sarah Sidery, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Thanks, Sarah.